My name is Gina Carano, and I play Natasha in Command & Conquer Red Alert 3. Gina Carano! She is undefeated in her campaign with a record of four wins, no losses, two wins coming by way of knockout. Don't be afraid of women with muscles, boys. We are not afraid of yours. Those boys need to learn how to fight more like girls. Toronto's made history for the female mixed martial arts game. Let's hear it for the women's face of MMA, Gina Carano! Jenny's my, my rival um, in Red Alert 3, and yes, yes, I think I could probably take her in an MMA fight without a problem, and I'd probably just, uh, you know, put her to sleep with a nice chokehold or something, just to make sure it's not too painful, because she seems like a pretty... Would you like me to show you how to fight like a girl? <laughs> Being a part of Red Alert 3 has just been awesome, and um, I'm super excited to see the end result and see put it all put together. Um, I'm really excited to have this new fan base, in a, and I think this is the start of like a whole relationship between me and video games, actually. I'm, I'm super stoked on it, man. <laughs> Field Marshal Bingham, I wanted to personally thank you for all your efforts in making this partnership successful. Well, that's appreciated, but you should thank our commander here. He's the one who led the assault on Gibraltar. It is indeed a pleasure, Commander. I hope you were satisfied with Natasha's contribution on the battlefield. She's one of our finest. Yes, well, we're going to need Natasha and every other resource at your command if we're going to take down that floating fortress in the North Atlantic. I concur. Good luck, gentlemen. Thank you. Conquer is like a really weird word. <laughs> it's like fork. Okay, Eye of the Tiger. Again. Again. Oh, I'm saying it? Eye of the Tiger. Oh, I'm okay. saying I, I thought I was giving the Eye of the Tiger. And, and you were, and I got that. Do you guys get the Eye of the Tiger? I was like envisioning tigers. In Mother Russia. <laughs> okay, I'm a Russian. Get rid of the second Soviet. In the script. Yeah, she can. There you go. <laughs> Those boys need to learn how to fight more like me. <laughs> Traj, as you can see, I'm behind the scenes of the Red Alert 3 cinematic shoot, and I'm joined by elite XC and mixed martial arts fighter Gina Carano. Gina, welcome to Battlecast Primetime. Thank you, thank you. So, Gina, you're a mixed martial arts fighter, you're an American gladiator, love the show, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> and you're now Natasha in Command and Conquer Red Alert 3. What could be better than that? Um, not much, man. I mean, I'm just kind of combining everything all into one with Natasha, I think, you know. So, um, what kind of things have you done today? Um, <laughs> a lot of pictures, a lot of posing, a lot of, um, speaking, just, you know, taking some cuts and, and learning Natasha's role, really. Has pummeling anyone with a fugil stick kind of prepared you for this role at all? It has in the way of, um, entertainment and, and getting my hair done and makeup and outfits and, it's a good thing that I got prepped um, in spandex before I came here and got prepped in leather, you know? So, it's cool. Nice. Now, you have a big fight coming up at uh, the end of this month, right? Yeah, big fight, huge fight. And that's, you're fighting... Um, I'm who? fighting Caitlin Young on CBS May 31st, um, and it's the first uh, network televised MMA fight, I guess, so we're going to be making a little bit of history, which is huge for women in the sport, so... Um, you know, there could be a little bit of pressure on the fight, but it's just gonna, it's just gonna rock. It's gonna be awesome. So what, what's kind of like your typical training montage? I mean, I've seen like Rocky doing his stuff, you know, cutting wood and things. You know, yeah. what kind of things do you do to get ready for a big fight? Um, I just got three, three areas that I like to focus on. Mental, spiritual, physical. And um, as long as each one of those is somewhat balanced and um, in control, then I know I can do good in the fight. Um, so it, it's a little bit hectic though because I'm filming for American Gladiators, you know, um, at the same time so I'm kind of double teaming it and I, it's probably not the smartest thing to do, um, but I'm just gonna, I think if anybody can do it, I can do it, so 
I'm in LA, all the LA gyms kind of opened up their hearts to me and like let me walk in and, and have trained with uh, you know different people here and there. Um, so I'm a little bit scattered right now, but I'm, I'm going to go home whenever I get the chance and train my ass off and just do my thing, you know? <laughs> just... Wait, well we're rooting for you. Yeah, you better be. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> so now I have to ask, you're an expert at fighting. So in a cage match between me and Raj Joshi, who do you think would win? Oh, didn't you tell me earlier I had to go with you? I, you I never said that. He I never, cheated. I never said that. <laughs> no, seriously. Uh, <laughs> you, man, you, of course, all the way, right here. There you go, see? Heard it there, Raj. So, <laughs> Gina Carno, thank you so much for coming on the show. Oh, thanks for having me. Back to you, Raj.